and if they're Hot Wheels collectors. Now, you know barn finds. Everybody goes round a certain rural area and sort of like finds an old car in a barn. Well, today I've sort of found that but with a Hot Wheels car and one I thought I had lost ages ago, either sold or got rid of or smashed. But nope, it was hiding. Okay, now... A lot of you will probably be sort of like saying, oh, I've done that, I found a Hot Wheels car I thought I got rid of, but it was just buried away or in a box somewhere. With mine, behind me, is my TV. Now, in front of that, as you can see, is sort of like some cars and stuff. I usually place cars there. The trouble is, though, there is a small little gap on the end there. It's about that big, and cars usually slide backwards into it, because it's not exactly level. So, um, what happens? I go and put the cars there from my last uh, car boot sale haul, and one of them decides to slip down the back to the point where I can't reach it with my fingers. So I thought, Ugh, how far back have you gone? Turn my phone on, put the torch on, had a look. Huh? What's that right at the back there? Right at the very back, tucked away, covered in dust from God knows how long being there, was this. This is a proper barn find Hot Wheels car. Look at the dust. Perfectly preserved, perfect in every way. Shame it's a soft top. I mean, it's going to take me forever to clean it in there. But, I mean, that is a genuine left untouched since... Probably since the mid-90s or late 90s or early noughties. I mean, I thought I had lost this one. There's no name on it. I can officially declare that. Oh, there it is. 93 Warner is what it says underneath. I'm just wondering. I thought I lost this as a child. Because I know for a fact that what I used to do is on my uh, on my windowsill behind me, I used to race my cars on there because it's got a nice surface and there was a lot of sun. But usually what would happen is if one got pushed off, it would usually fall down and fall behind the back of my bed. And I'd lose it. But thankfully, I did find all of them. I thought that's what happened to this one. But no. Nope. I have literally just discovered it a few moments ago, and I mean, look at that, look at the, look at that dust on that, I mean that is, that's been underneath there for a good few, I think that's been underneath there for a century, so that will go in the collection, it's just amazing, it's alright, you, you think, you really do have to think about it, so that's what you need to do, you need to sort of like look through boxes, um, Label stuff, remember stuff, write it down, put it on your computer, iPhone, whatever. Just basically make sure that if you do have something like that, you remember to write it down. Because otherwise, if you don't and it goes missing, well, you might be like me. You find it when you're either moving stuff around, or when something like that happens. I suppose really it's sort of like the um, remember all scene in Toy Story 2 with Jesse. It's like a case of once uh, the girl's growing up, she gets put underneath the bed and all the dust gathers. Only when sort of like her handbag drops and a bit of makeup rolls under that she finds her. Well, this is exactly what I did with that. One of my Hot Wheels cars rolls back and it would have stayed there unless I had known it. So I shall get this one cleaned up and it will hopefully be uh, in a bit better condition. Right, I've basically come back and uh, after giving it a serious good clean to have a look at a bit more detail at a car I thought I lost 10 years ago plus because I was smashing cars up at an almighty rate. I think I have not seen this car ever since. I've not seen another model like it so maybe it was a once in a lifetime run or did it uh, get a final run sometime. I mean it looks like it's an absolutely perfect track car perfect for customising as well. I mean, I don't know what it's based on, but it's a 93 Warner, so perhaps maybe it was a 93 new model. It is an absolutely gorgeous car to have, and just to show you underneath. There it is. 93 Warner. It's got the five uh, hole Lambo wheels. Again, it's an absolutely brilliant one. As you can see, it's cleaned up beautifully. Thankfully, no restoration is needed on it, because it's rust free. It was just covered in a lot of dust. Anything I can't do, I might have to get a bit more sort of uh, 
from a cotton bud or something in the interior it's still very dusty in there but again I've cleaned it up as best I can so it'll be photographed and it will go with the others so I'm really proud of that anyway just remember always keep hold of your stuff and if you think you've lost something don't think it's gone forever just remember to rummage around a bit look in boxes look anywhere look in anywhere that sort of like you would play with as a child look under furniture and stuff even if it's heavy furniture because you can probably guarantee probably half your Hot Wheels collection or a lot of small cars or toys and stuff has gone underneath there thanks for watching